Hi Lucas! Finally, you're back from your vacation. Did you have a good time? Yes, it was awesome. I saw so many interesting things. And the funniest thing happened. An octopus grabbed my foot when I was standing on a rock near the water. It was probably just trying to taste your foot, with its arms. Taste my foot? With its arms? Yes. Octopuses use their arms to taste things. How can they taste things with their arms? Octopuses use their arms to touch, just like we do. But octopuses also have suckers on their arms. These suckers have cells on them, that allow them to taste what they are touching. Those cells are called chemoreceptors. That's weird. Why can't they just taste with their mouths? Don't octopuses have mouths? Yes, they have mouths. But by tasting with their arms, octopuses can tell if something is toxic, and dangerous for them, or not. So if it's toxic, they don't put it in their mouths. That's pretty clever. Yes, especially since octopuses don't always watch where they put their arms. Sometimes they'll stick their arms in holes in rocks, to search for prey. So they can't always see what they're touching. By tasting whatever it is they are touching, they can tell if it's good to eat or not. How do they do that? When an octopus touches something with the suckers on their arms, the chemoreceptors pick up its chemical substance. This substance gives the octopus information about the thing it's touching. Then, the chemoreceptors use the nervous system in the octopus body, to send a signal with this information to the brain. The brain then compares this information, with other information it already has stored. Like what? Like, if the octopus has tasted something similar before, and was it okay to eat? So the brain remembers what's okay to eat, and what's not okay to eat. If the octopus has eaten something similar before, and it was okay to eat, then it will eat this thing it's touching now as well. If it has eaten something similar before, and it wasn't okay to eat, then it won't eat this thing now either. That is so cool! Can any other animals taste with their arms? I don't know. I know that flies and butterflies, taste with their feet. And humans and most other animals taste with their tongues. And then, the information about what it is we are tasting, gets sent to the brain, through our nervous system. And then our brain uses the information it already has, to tell us if what we are tasting is okay to eat. Exactly. Well, I'm glad the octopus tasted my foot and decided it wasn't good to eat. Me too. Hey, I'm hungry. Let's go find something to eat. After we've tasted it with our tongues, of course. <laughs>